circuit boards in, and there's usually four on a panel. And someone installs the IC chips by hand, um, which is probably one of the hardest jobs. They're really small. It's really hard to make it clean and accurate and fast, but they do a pretty good, pretty good job. In fact, they do a really good job. So now they have a circuit board with chips installed. We have a lot number for, we do 36 of these, so 12, 12 panels of four. And they write that lot number on there. And they apply this heat resistant klepton tape to everything that we don't want the holes filled with solder that are gonna get soldered on this side of the board. So they take these, they do that, they put them on these jigs and they pull these through hole resistors out and bend them individually, stuff these four. After they populate those boards by hand, it goes to what we call the dip, which is like a semi-automated soldering process. It solders all of those parts in and then cuts those long leads from underneath. Then it comes back up here to QC. They flip it over, they check all of those joints, they check this side to make sure everything looks good. And then they install all of these pots. And between that and assembly over here is enclosure production, which happens in our other facility down the street at 411, what we call it. They get, they get that, they get this, they put them together, um, and they install all of those parts in. So it looks like that. Once they're assembled, they come to a wiring station here, where there's usually like a bunch of the same pedal all linked together. And they have a guitar, and they have a loop pedal. And each pedal has its own different testing process, but they're all tested individually. Um, they play certain loops through them. They do certain tests of certain knobs and where they should be. Um, make sure they're all good. They do whatever wiring is required. Usually it's either two wires or even at this point, it's just a, a socket that they have to install. Um, and they just make sure they're, they sound great and put the knobs on. solder paste right onto that board that you're looking at, um, exactly on the pads. And this is a, uh, a, a pencil that goes in this machine like this, put solder paste on it. Solder paste is uh, basically like really sticky paste flux with microscopic balls of solder on it. This applies back to Boards. The board comes through the bottom, she pulls them down and squeezes it on, basically just like a squeeze Yep. This head in the middle has four nozzles that will come pick up a part, place it on the board where it's supposed to go. Um, it picks it up with like pneumatic vacuum, and each one has a little camera that will pick it up, look at that part, and compare it to a reference picture we've shown it to make sure it's the right part and the right polarity and install it straight. I could pick it up sideways, but it will correct for that. It's super fast, it's really an awesome machine. If you look over here, uh, this is a surface mount hook that just came off of that line and that's kind of what it looks like. Over here are data corruptors. 
that would then look like going straight off of that line. There's a lot of, this one has the most amount of the surface mount chips that we're doing by hand over there. It definitely takes the longest in that IC process, and this does it so well and so fast. And there's a, these joints are excellent. They're really shiny, reliable, strong. So once it's done there, they put them up on a rack over here, and instead of going to a different station and having all those three little parts installed, the few parts there. It's so fast now because there's so few three little parts that a person can sit here, install with the jacks and the few things that are going to go through the uh, So this is a weight soldering machine. It's kind of the evolution of that dip. It's faster, it's way more consistent, the joints are perfect. Um, and we don't have to like, we don't have to spray the flux by hand like we do over there. It's really messy, it's really hot, messy work. It's hard to do well. This sprays it automatically. And that's the, that's the whole production process over here. Uh, if you guys have any questions, feel free to ask, but I'm just gonna walk you back the other side.